So we are, uh, I'm at Somas Mill. And beautiful Port Alberni, where we have lots of trees. Yeah, there we go. It's just like a big conveyor out there with a big uh, link body that lays it on there and just slowly takes it up. So this is, uh, they got booms all out here. These guys will go and they'll cut some of them and bring them in the pond, they call. And they got the guy in the boat just to call it a sidewinder. I don't know why they call it a sidewinder, but then he comes along and pushes them over here. This guy just takes them and feeds them up to go upstairs. The guy up there in the log deck is the guy that controls that. It's just a big chain they lay on there just to ride up the hill. We'll go up there, you can have a look. That's all, it was just moving. That's the cutoff saw to trip the log. It's like when the wood comes up and he decides what length to make it. These, these, these are called jacking rolls, they just lift the log right up and the power saw turns on and comes down and it'll cut it in half, pull the conveyor and if it needs to be uh, chipped or barked, I should say, it'll go through this big ring barker. It's got, it's got like a big knife that kind of goes slower on it. And just, it's not really nice, it's got really big like, pokes that are sticking out of it. And it just goes around and just kind of grinds the log up a little bit and then it ends up like opens over there. You can see the first couple have big old lines in them, grooves, those have been barked. Taking the bark right off them. Well, these ones like this are going to be looking ring bark type thing. They get through a ring marker and the bark is taken off. Sometimes it doesn't take the bark off. Or it's not round enough, it won't work. Well, that's the head rig. There's also a log on there. You'll see the first one on the log. Take the log by feet. Now the can refers to the uh, on both sides, the rounded edge on both sides. Well, I know it's all thick and it's got an eight claws that move. You can see the laser line. Watching your boots and saws. That one over there has uh, 16 saws, they don't do it. You want to show oh, the laser? You make it out wide, you want to make it? Down, machine, lower it down, 
and those arms will open up and there's a gap down there and it'll drop on the, on the chain. The whole load will spill out. There we go. guys would stand here on the green chain? Seven. Three on this side and four on the other. And they used to have a little, little green chain over there for the shorter pieces. They don't have that anymore. This is like four inches thick here, but this has been cut off as a sitting sideways in the log. And the log cut through it. And then it falls. And they'll run, run through it. There's an etcher. It's got saws. They'll cut it. And it cuts them in two inch strips or inch and three quarters. And then you have a two by four yeah. or two by six. You know, cut a real, cut a real wide piece, you know, to get a big cat. So they just got a bunch of extra sitting out here at the mill. Get the edges down for a saw change or something. They keep the head rig going, and they make pieces so they can bring them back in later and get more production. Big thing. So all cedar. Yeah. Yeah, everything's cedar here.